Yo, 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 welcome back to another video, it's your boy, Sawbuzz, everybody, another video, playing some more, um, Mafia 3, and we'll be back with another one, so, we about to focus on some story mission on this one, so, yeah, man, we're getting back into the story, we were doing, grinding on some side missions, but, man, until you guys see that, let me know if y'all want to see actually see them side missions or want to see them off camera because I feel like them side missions kind of, they give it like a story mission vibe to it so just let me know just because I don't like to run through missions like that you feel me I guess Because I just ate. Then I guess I'm good. I could go for some ice cream later on. Yeah, sure, I'll keep that in mind. What's this all about? We're meeting a friend at the Cuban restaurant in the French ward. They call Villa de Mar. I'll fill you in on the way. Let's go. This friend would be someone I know? Nah, ex come ah, Watch the road! Watch it! That was in my way. Anyway. Nah, ex-company pal Robert Marshall. As a line of an asshole we worked with before your time. Man by the name of Connor Aldridge. I remember the name. Two of you had some kind of fallout. out. The fallout would suggest there was a time we were in. You're dragging my ass around town because of something that go down. Look, all you need to know is that Aldridge is a traitorous cocksucker who got good men killed. And if he's in New Bordeaux, I promise you it's not for the booze and cheap blowjobs. Your taste in music leaves a lot to be desired. Yeah? But when I want to know what you think about my music, I'll smack you upside the head. I'm sorry, I can't listen to this anymore. Sorry to keep you ladies waiting. Robert Marshall. Johnny Boy and I work together at the company. Excuse me. You know, I gave you a shot to sit in the back seat and you didn't take it. Boom. Mm. <laughs> Ungrateful fuck. Uh, sorry about that. Marshall here is one of New Bordeaux's finest bounty hunters. Is that a cattle prod? Works every time. Although it does create a hell of a mess when my skips shit themselves. I'll keep that in mind. So what did you learn about Aldrich? Well, Bertie told me he's been sniffing around our favorite Cuban bartender, Horatio Balmana. Balmana? Are you sure? Afraid so. If Aldrich is such a big deal, why is he exposing himself over a bartender? Therein lies the question, my dark-skinned compadre. Let's go. Alright. Looks like someone was intent on keeping folks inside. Let's get in there. God damn. No more plantains for me. Hello? Anyone here? What kind of sick fuck shoots up a birthday party? Aldrich doesn't see the world the way we do. There is no order and there are no rules that he won't break. That's why I had to get away from him. And that life. That. Each night my head is the pillow. No, I'm thinking of you, my love. My dreams are filled with magic. Images of your body. The sensation of... My hands running on your thighs, your hands on me, your lips meeting my lips, you are, I need no man, not 
like a five and with he puts a part for my song. Love to cheat, baby. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh. What the hell? I hope I said the name. I think it's G. Yes, we do. G or something. I'm still breathing. I'd say it's not looking good. I'll cover you boys from down here. Are you sure about Marshall? Man, seems kind of tilted. Tilted? Nah, he's good. Is this uh, fella down here still alive? Oh, wait, no, that's, uh, that's Bryce. False alarm, he's dead. Okay, yeah. So maybe he's a little off. Over there! God damn. Me, Horatio Balmana. <sighs> Shit. Really? What? It's a nutman. Balmana was a pilot in the Cuban Revolutionary Armed Forces. Back in November 62, the Navy found him and a couple of his pals floating in the Gulf and they brought him in. Which is where you come in, I suppose. I was already in Nam, but I heard about it. Almana spilled everything he knew about Castro. We planted a news story about the crew being found dead. And that poor bastard ended up here, tending bar. The way his hands got up, Aldridge knows what he's doing. He was trying to get Balmana to talk. You all right? Huh? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah! I got him. Now my car is right there, bro. I'm gonna take time out of day. Don't let the car trucker get away. If I'm driving like this, he's gonna get wet. Bro, he went through that? Thank you, but it's like a goddamn hold up. Motherfucker, this wire. Do the best I can here. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. Why the hell did you make me chase you like that? Alright, let's go. Fernando, la gente me llama, huh? People call me Chucky. You let people call you Chucky? <laughs> Why would you? You don't forget it. There's a dead man upstairs named Balmana. Yeah, so? So, the man we're after is the one who shot the living shit out of this place. What's that got to do with me? You're not too bright. Are you Chucky? Oh, fuck! Oh. You're the sole survivor of a goddamn massacre. That's what it's got to do with you. So, tell us what you heard. All right, all right. Dami, the man who came in here, he was asking about a house. How? Uh, what house? I, I don't know. But I refused to say anything, and then he started screaming. Then he gave him a name, Pedro. Pedro Pan. Say it again, so I can hear it. Pedro. Pedro Pan. Jesus Christ. And that was oh! it. He, he, he told another man he was with that they need to get the crew to the flank as quickly as possible. That's everything I hear. I'm my mother. <laughs> The 
mean anything to you. Pedro Pond's the code name for a CIA safe house here in the city. Can you keep our pal here on ice back at your place? Sure thing. All right, let's go check out your new digs, princess. Oh. Two of you find yourselves in need of sniper support. Hit me up on the radio. Adios, Chucky. Stand up. All right, so I'm kind of glad this is because he come in clutch when you need him. We can't just sit here. We need to get our asses to the safe house. The paper pen safe house is located in an old distillery. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I want to say this is fucking um, DLC for. Stones unturned. This is a fucking what's the name? This is oh, this nigga. They was trying to get me. I just remember, bro. They ain't about to get me like that. That's a um, what's the name? I'm not trying to do that. I'm trying to say all the DLCs. But let's go. Bro, I'm not doing that. They say meet him there. I'm going with you. <laughs> From the looks of that restaurant, all the types of well trained men work in it. No surprise. Cocksucker was always partial to freelancers. I could see the appeal of using mercenaries myself. Didn't see you complaining when that young NSF Patani saved their asses last year. Those some mean motherfuckers. Maybe they were on our side. <laughs> Mercs aren't exactly known for being cuddly. Wouldn't last long if they were. Yeah, I can't even get the car, fool. They said, I'm running out. Okay, that's cool. Boys in blue want to have a word, Lincoln. Come on, kill me, bro. I can't even get the car. I left my cigarettes back at the restaurant. Brother, you need to get yourself some money. Your ass is one tight. Well, that, I think we right. lost him. Why the fuck are you so hard for this cat? And don't give me any of that traitor's fuck shit. Well, all that may be true. There's something else here. You and me, we've been through a lot of shit. Good shots, good shots, good boys. Good shots, boys. I do not want to do that much, bro. They really thought like that. They, they trying to keep me in the car, fool. I could not even get out. The Pedro Pan safe house is located Nigger. in an Come old on. distillery in the southwest corner of the bayou. All right, let's go. So that person is at the time right now. I'm not trying to do this though. Like y'all not understand it. Activate. Yeah. So how was this? Um, let me see. Abort bench. I could have did that. <laughs> I could have did that. Like, would you? Ah. Yeah, they took a death. Like, would you? Oh. Alright, so Okay, so I know. And then this is gonna try me this right back over here. Alright. So fuck it since we right over here, let's just go do this one. Usually I'll do like a Sandra and then Vito and then Bert. 
well, next week, Beetle was supposed to be last for me, technically, that's how I always did it for some reason. Clerk's office, and your friend said you could help with this guy blackmailing me. What kind of juice makes you some more black man? My office approves new projects under development. I, I fucked up, cheated on my wife, and this guy, Jimmy Cavar, filmed it. Come to find out, a girl worked for Cavar too. And now he owns you. He's forced me to rubber stamp phony building projects and cash the checks for his company, Cavar Construction. Probably seen the signs of a building in a new city hall. Thing is, Caval doesn't really come around unless there's a problem. Don't worry. I'm pretty good at causing people problems. Some of his men hang out around downtown. Look, I ain't a bad guy. I, I just made a mistake is all. Keep your head down, Lenny. I'll pay Caval's men a visit. See what they know. Caval just people know more about what he's doing in our life. What have I got myself right. into? Alright, hopefully, I'm going to get copyright. Because I know I need to start doing better on that. Because, like, you know, when you, when you reach that level 
uh, like the shit gonna affect you. That shit gonna hit hard, bro. I, I don't need that in my life. <laughs> Feel me? Those are hard to even get to this level. Like, see, like, if I, like, if I hire an uh, editor or whatever, like, a person that actually knows how to do all this stuff, yeah, that would be cost me money, bro. Like, I, I make too many damn videos to, to, to think, to think that is uh, something that I could do like that, you feel me? I, would, I make too many videos. Bar combat. I make too many videos. I got two channels up just gaming. Yeah, I got the music channel and all that. I'm like, eh. I think you and I are supposed to talk. Harold Colley, the Tattler. I'm covering DeRazio's little corruption racket. Can't imagine it's good for your health, naming names in the Marcano organization. Didn't you hear? Even cigarette smoke will kill you. So here's what I know. We've got city officials taking bribes. Blackmail. Juicy stuff. At the center of it all is a fellow named Frankie Bernard. The problem is... I don't know where he operates. Might make it kind of hard to find him. Ah, but the thing is, I hear Mr. Bernard uses debt drops. Spots where his people leave bribes for officials to pick up. And I just happen to know where they are. I also understand Frankie keeps a sweet blackmail stash of every dirty deal he's done. I'll see if I can't get one of those couriers to give up the location for your mystery man. And his little blackmail stash. The people working for Bernard are just as secretive as he is. You might have to find some way to get them to talk. It draws Frankie Bay attention on the. Actually, but I can't really friend this in this area. It's crazy. I do want to get this medical thing. No, <laughs> hang on, cat. Stay. Let's keep it moving. Because like, I always give this area to like Vito because like, it is fit, fit Vito style, you know, like by just having, you know, like he did like not flashy, but like more suitable for this area. Like it's fit Vito than anything. So Let's get it. So let's you know the thing. This one here. Yeah. That's it. Let me see that territory. Asshole, this is a restricted area. I'm bad player. I know where you're going. Um, I need to get closer. Alright, kick back. What's your ball? Hey, is that gun? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> You're gonna tell me what you know about Frankie Bernard. Mr. Bernard has some bag men making drops. All I know is the kind of car they're driving. You run with me now. So since we are like kind of messed up in, in a way, we ain't gonna do all of these. 
this in this video, so I might get up there. Okay. Up here. So we're gonna go and do a little bit. I might do I don't know how much that first part cost, but I might just do boom 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 and finish finish it. Then like the second one, like the second video is gonna be a long one by you just finish and basically everything with the top boss of the situation and all and yeah. Get this medical thing right here. I don't even know if I could get it. Or. <laughs> yep, can't get it. But if I do come back over here, at least the door open already. Alright, so let's go to here. Oh. Like it, like it would be crazy if I put somebody else here. It's just like I don't know. I be putting people where they need to go. Like off, just like you know, like based on the person. You feel me? Oh, this thing about to fall, but he, he's gonna make it, bro. He's gonna make it. Bro. That shit is not ain't gonna blow up. Like. <laughs> Oh, 
I'm gonna do it off of this plant somewhere right there. But hold on before I do that. Oh, how is still more people here? Oh, they over there. I want y'all to destroy this on how much as I can, you feel me? So. I'm trying to get the most money and everything. Alright, so Mr. Carver going over there. Yo, going over your latest bid is a pair you estimate your unreasonable hot. I understand we have our arrangement, but I'm concerned about the burning. Uh, this may be put on the average tax payers. Please stop. Alright, so we can discuss. Alright, so we gotta go up again. So you kind of lost me already if you want to be real. I'm on this side. I'm trying to get most money and everything from these people. Found a damn corpse. Oh, we got a body armor too? Hey, no more. Hey, no more. Look over here now. Take a little few more damage. I wish I had like a little medicin medical thing. That's what I mean. So give me that. Let's try over here. Hyper point. You see how much money we get in now? There's be a process to it. And I got all ones. One, 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 one. <laughs> Bro, the fact that y'all really still trying to impress on looking. looking on I'm kind of mad at the fact that I, I, I literally wasted the damn um, grenade on them. Who did this to my car? They fucking scam. It's like you really gonna have this nigga shoot me like that. It was a whole kind of scene, nigga.
Where you think you got me? Oh, what you got now? A little album of the place. Tell me what you know about Frankie Bernard. The boss is running things out of the Imperial Bath Health Spa. He's keeping the politicians in line with dirty pictures he's got stashed there. My crew will be in touch. Alright, yeah, so... Man, I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna be in sleep right now. Well, try to try and go to sleep because I gotta wake up early because I'm about to go paintballing tomorrow. Well, technically, it's to like later today. Alright, I'm supposed to go paintball with my brother. And we're trying to go like as soon as open. Uh, or like, 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 like the first time I went to paintball on my first time like it was cool because the gun actually worked but this is some private shit last one Yeah, like the first time I went, um, like, what's the name? Like, oh, shit. Like, the guns actually worked, but the second time, the gun wasn't, like, it shoot, and then it just, like, fall out, basically, like, like, I was shooting does, basically, like, so I'm like, that's fucked up. <laughs> but, like, before I, like, did the whole recording session, I was telling them, like, okay, I should be finished by, like, 11, we'll go to sleep, you feel me? And like, it's, like, 12 o'clock, about to be 1. Like, bro. So. I gotta hurry up. Well, not hurry up, but. Um, but, technically, it, it is gonna be the end of the video, because we're gonna save this side for the next video. And then, we're gonna, like, do, like, the main bosses and stuff like that, take down wherever this nigga name that control this area <laughs> um but we gonna do boom boom all these let me come back so so yeah man so man if y'all like that video like it comment subscribe turn on post notifications because i don't want to miss no videos coming out and nothing being said have a blessed day